Mr. Baez. Oh, hi. Hi. Sorry. I was reading about the Nancys. Your favourites? Jodie. She'd literally do anything. I don't know if she would do anything. Not many people would get on the front of them, on their hands and knees in front of Lloyd Webber, I don't think. Not an attractive man. Interesting. No, no, no. Back a bit. Oh. I'll do anything. Nah, it's proper. Does it come out? 22nd? 22nd of May. Have you ever noticed on um, these I do anything strictly come dancing? They do them now, the, the results on a Sunday, but they quite clearly filmed it on the Saturday straight afterwards because people in the audience are the same, they wear the same clothes, they're in the same position. You, they actually do it on the same night. But how does no one find out? How can there be one leak over the day? Does that not astound you? Never thought of that. <laughs> I look forward. So Sundays at 7.20 to find out what poor slapper has been voted off, literally. And, um, you know, that, that, that's how it is. But uh, anyway. I have to say, Neve, though, I think, the young... She's growing, are you? 17 from Northern Ireland. It scares me. All right, she's studying A-level drama, so she might be a bit young. But I think she's stunning. She scares me. Really? I think she's bunny boiler. Proper no, bunny boiler. I think she's quite... quite uh, that's my mother in the background. Don't worry, I haven't filmed you today. And, uh, yeah. So, anyway, I'll do anything. Another week? Another blog. Well, another two weeks, I think, probably. Yeah. Um, you're back at your mum and dad's. Yeah, yeah. Um, so talk us through, I suppose, a lot of people have been wondering what's going on. Yeah, I've had a, I've had a couple of emails. Well, I've had a few, lot of emails from people. Where are you? Are you alive? I haven't responded. Not that doesn't I, help them. Not because I've been like, sick humour, but I didn't want it. Um, I haven't been good. You know, I had a bit of a setback since you last saw me. Um, I got let out of hospital last week. I need to be out of hospital for less than 24 hours before I was back in. Right. Uh, I had a form of... Uh, sorry, my mother is nuts. Uh, a form of very extreme but diarrhea. Okay. That, um, is that dysentery? It is dysentery. Um, that, that, that's, they needed me in for, they needed to examine and put me on drips and for four or five days I was... Uh, dripping yourself? Dripping in, a drip in and a drip out. Nice. There's a song there somewhere. So um, I was uh, in a bit of a bad way. Um, and and it's very demoralising. Feel better? A little bit brighter, but you know it's. You look better. Thanks. It's very hard. I I underestimated the aftermath of the surgery. Yeah, you know, I found out they where they sliced me open. They then took my insides out and put it on a table next to me and sifted through it. Rebuilding a balance next to you. Yeah. Like me plumbing and reworking, so things are taking a lot longer right. to, 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 to get better. Main problem being digestion. I have a problem with digestion. Um, obviously, that was what was infected. Eating wise, now at the moment, I can't eat a full meal. It's um, it causes you me never could eat one of your mum's full meals because you're not fair. Terrible cooking, but even now, you know, like. If, if you put in front of me a McDonald's, I'd have, if I, if I ate just a, just a burger, fries and a, and a, and a Diet Coke, yeah. I would be having terrible indigestion afterwards. I've got to eat very small meals frequently. Um, and it's very difficult to get your mind over and get your mind around and you sit there and you think, will I ever be able to go out to a restaurant again? Will I ever be able to do this? Hopefully... Why would, would you think that? Because your life is not what it was at the moment, you know. Um, do you not? But do you not feel that it's just a nightmare at the moment? Yeah, yeah. But there is a chance that my stomach won't expand. The, okay. You know, it's sort of maybe just that's what happens with surgery. Hopefully, it will ease. Um, so you almost can eat anything you like, but you can't even eat them. Yeah. You've yeah. been. You had to eat all this healthy stuff. 
before the operation. And I'm, and I'm ten stone. You know, I, I, I look in the mirror and I look like I know it sounds terrible and I don't want to talk, but I look like I'm coming out of a concentration camp. I see my ribs, I see bones in my legs. It's just not what I was, what I thought would happen after the surgery. I thought after the surgery, within cut three weeks, I'll be on my feet, running around, tubes will be out. They say it's going to be three to six months. Whereas in a bizarre twist of fate, your hair is flying at the moment. My hair's growing back. Um, you know, my body's trying to return. I had the pathology reports back. Um, the good news was they did get all the tumour out. There was some bad news that there was uh, 3 out of 18 lymph nodes, which is blood vessel streams, if you like, were infected, which were not a lot. Uh, and the chemo may have killed it already, but I need to still have some post-op chemo to mop up rather than to cure. Yeah. Um, doesn't mean that I, am, I may have some cancer cells. Mm. Oh, hang on a second. It's <laughs> <laughs> got a funny ring. I think we just let it go. Yeah, yeah. What is that sound? Is that Barry on the piano? No, I don't know. I don't know. You know... <laughs> this is what happens. This is what happens live TV. This is my life. So, um, I, I just, um, I anticipated the surgery. Uh, it's going to take three to six months for me to fully recover from this. And because of the fact that I've got chemo as well, it's going to take me close to six um, to recover from it. All but that. looking back six months ago from now... Yeah, you know, they still say I'm a miracle. You know, if anyone wants... God forbid any of you ever get cancer. And unfortunately, one in three people will get cancer. So basically, 333 of our users are likely to get, or viewers are likely to get it. Yeah. You know, you Tune in next week for more good information. You, you, you can't think you're going to die. No. You know, I was told I was going to die. I was told I had less than 1% chance to live. Here I am, six months later, cancer free, with the odd cancer cell in my body. Everyone's got the odd cancer cell in their body. But my, I'm susceptible to them forming a tumour, so they're trying to eradicate them from my body. Right. Um, I've had the big, I've had 11 hour surgery. I should be absolutely euphoric that I'm alive. But you don't seem to be. No, I'm fed up. I'm, I'm down, I'm on antibiotics, I'm on daily injections, I'm uh, having problems digesting food, and it gets you down, it gets you down. I, I have got nothing to do during the day. I'm bored still. I don't have the brain to read a book. I Learn language, nothing like that. No, I just don't have anything to do. I'm just fed up, you know. And, it, and I don't have the energy to see people really that much. You know, people want to come and visit. And part of me was, yeah, great, but I don't want to be looked at with pity or, or sympathy. I've never wanted that. And I've got to feel strong in myself to start seeing my friends again. Yeah. So that, that, that's where I am. That's why not a lot of people have heard from me. And, and, and but we will try and do this back yeah, on a weekly basis. Yeah, and back on a weekly basis. And, you know, hopefully every week I'll get that bit stronger and you'll get the happier me again. Okay, well... Um, um, also, very quickly, I have four Bruce Springsteen tickets that I can't go to because I'm too weak on the 30th of May at the Emirates. Now, if you want to go, email in the blog at hotmail.co.uk with your offer... The highest offer will win, and we'll give the money. Or do it as a comment. Offer as a comment against the video. Or as well. offer as a comment. And Wonderful. the highest offer, you can go to the concert, and uh, the money will go to charity. Wonderful. Thanks. Thank you. Bye. See you next week.